Guys, this video is about one fight. One super fight against Tyrone Woodley. I'm going to take him down. I want two titles on my shoulder within the octagon, being the true champion, the greatest of all time. I want those two titles. I want them. But first of all, we have to do a commercial. <laughs> the final week of training is up. So let's promote the fight in the best way possible. Commercial time. That's all week five gone. Which is not the best preparation. Let's be honest. Also, I might have changed my toes. <laughs> Again. He got them removed, okay? He's got a lot of money. Or he might have moved them around. I don't know. <laughs> Scott Green is ready. We should have a very, very high hype for this fight. So we've done a, a cover for UFC. We've done some Ultimate Team stuff with UFC. Done a commercial shoot. You haven't missed anything. Every time I click on the UFC stuff, the EA stuff, nothing happens. The commercial is all I've seen. So don't, don't worry guys, it's fine. Let's jump into this fight. This is gonna be an insane fight. Fitness at 96%, no injuries. We're feeling pretty good. Uh, attributes have not really changed though. It's a pretty bad training. I was, I was doing a lot of stuff with hype and motion. Wasn't the best. I did switch my camp. That, that is true. I went to the um, jujitsu, yeah, the big jujitsu gym. But yeah, I didn't really get a chance to really do much. Which kind of sucks. Oh, here we go. Some paths must eventually cross. And as two of the greatest fighters in the UFC kept dominating their opposition, it was inevitable that this moment would come. When the octagon door closes for tonight's super fight, the talk will be over. And the entire sports world will come to a halt. This is no ordinary fight. It's a battle between two champions willing to put their own divisional crowns on the line to prove themselves worthy to be on top. And when the dust settles, there can only be one winner, a king with two crowns. We've seen it before. Can it happen again? Can Coming we get two belts? How good is this? A matchup ah. for the UFC welterweight division title. Champion versus champion. Oh, this is going to be good. All right, so here he is, the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC champion. But tonight, an opportunity of a lifetime to etch his name in the history books as one of only a handful of fighters to be a simultaneous two-division UFC champion. Conor McGregor was the first to do it. This fighter can join him in short order if he can get the win against another champion here tonight. As he makes his way towards his cage, he believes this is his time. He believes he is destined to take this title. His preparation for this bout has gone absolutely according to plan. He's in fantastic shape with a great game plan, and he expects to walk out of his cage tonight as the new champion. He is the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC welterweight champion in a division full of killers. He has remained the hunted at 170 pounds. Now, unquestionably staring at his toughest challenger to date, can he go back home as the champion? If he can, another chapter to one of the greatest welterweight legacies the Octagon has ever seen. The champion is in focus. He is in his prime. He's making his way towards the cage. His training for this camp has been absolutely spectacular. He believes he has a solid game plan, and his mentality coming into this fight is clear and focused. Tail the tape for this welterweight championship fight. So more than 15 years, the gap in age between these two fighters with some differences in height and a similar reach. All right, we send it back inside the octagon. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. And now, 
This is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the Honda Center in Anaheim, California. <laughs> Fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer for the professional record of 24 wins, one loss. He stands six feet one is tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of London, England, presenting the challenger, Green. And now, introducing the champion. This man is a mixed martial artist with a professional record of 23 wins, 3 losses, and 1 draw. He stands 5 feet 9 inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds, fighting out of St. Louis, Missouri, USA. Ladies and gentlemen, presenting the reigning, defending UFC welterweight champion of the world, Harlan the Chosen One. All right, this is for the championship. You've been giving your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. You will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. Let's make it official. You ready to fight? You ready? I'm ready. Right, go. I'm good. If this goes to the ground, we are. Ooh. You down. Let's go back up, though. Ooh, that looked tasty. That looked tasty. Oh. Just oh, missed you with are a huge one kick. cheeky son of a bitch. Oh! How about that shin? Ah, he keeps backing away. He's clever, this one, isn't he? He's clever. He's clever, isn't he? Oh, and he tags him with the straight. Nice job there by He loves Green. it. He loves getting it in the face. You know it. Woodley, you twat. What are you doing? So his opponent lands that kick to the body, Joe, and he has he shown does. an increased susceptibility to oh. the strike here tonight. Really? Woodley gets tagged by happen. that stiff jab. Defense not there for him thus far tonight. Wow, yet another punch to the head by Green. He tries to grab me there. Good concern. He's going to try and grab me again, isn't he? Oh! Ooh! Oh, Tasty! Oh, he's, he's recovered a little bit. I don't really want to be on the floor right now. Great. Cost her up. You know it. All right, fine. No, nope, no. Nope. What is he doing? He's trying to reverse it. Great. I did not want to be on the floor right now. Oh, come on, let me get up, please. Come on. He's cheap. We don't want this. No one wants to see this. No one wants to see this, you absolute pleb. Let me get up. You are annoying as fuck, honestly. Let me get up. There we go. I'm up. Oh. All right, this is not what we want right now. I managed to hold him off. Break. Yes, break. Hold him off. Nice. Well done, Scott Green. Woo. Not going quite to plan. Attempts a big hook to the head, but misses. And both guys really throwing with authority. Oh, beautiful technique on that straight punch. You're like a cheap corner, mate. Honestly. Swing and a miss by Woodley. Ooh. Good defense there. He lands a super Did I land the Superman punch? I think I landed it a little bit. This is level five now. No ah! That's it again. Going to the body now with that hook shot. Nicely done by the chosen one. By the chosen one. What a name. Oh, hello. This could be it right here. The that was tasty. Right oh my god. He cannot take those head kicks. Hey, first round knockout in the ultimate super fight of all time. Beautiful shot to end the fight right there. It couldn't have been much more flush than it did and I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming quite frankly. So near could not take the head kick. He was actually his movement was quite good, but as soon as I hit any of my leg kicks 
the opponent Let's just take a doesn't like him. Just look at the staggers. power in this right hand as Ooh. it lands. Picture down, man. for the knockout. Here we see it again. Bam! Like a jab. Was, I think it's just a straight jab. So Boom. he did it. Yes. He wins the super fight and makes UFC history by joining Give me select few that second bell. Give me the second bell. I want it. Hall of Fame. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 28 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout and new undisputed UFC welterweight champion of the world, Reed. Where's my goddamn well, second bell? His name to the list of the greatest fighters in UFC history. I got two belts on them both. As he becomes where, where's my second belt? UFC Give me my second belt. Yeah, there we go. Oh, this looks pretty. Oh, this looks good. I'll make this look good. Right now, you are oh, yeah. At a two -division UFC champion. Oh, he loves it. Absolutely loves it. Absolute power. The guy... Whoa, wait, it's a big jump. And we just smashed him in the face. Over and over again. Try to take it to the ground. We got out and smacked him one. 37 strikes hit. Woo! Compared to these 18 strikes. There we go. The round one was almost over. Almost. Career earnings. 7.4 million. Win the super fight. Longevity's gone down a little bit. Gained a bunch of fans. Wowzers! How many people tuned into that fight? 3.2 million pretty much. Pay per view buyers. Wowzers. Absolute monster fight. Unreal. I'm Megan Olivia, and this is your UFC Minute. Remember when we were telling you that you shouldn't miss this past weekend's monumental super fight? I hate to be that person, but we told you so. The fans were buzzing, the world was watching, and the Honda Center in Anaheim, California was at capacity last weekend when the UFC lightweight champion challenged the welterweight title holder in an epic super fight. When it was over, he had silenced the critics and made history as one of only a handful of fighters to become a world champion in two weight classes. That's it for today. Stay tuned for your next UFC Minute, and I'll see you at the fights. <laughs> A champion in two weight classes. Not just one, but two. And still the weight, welterweight champion. Damn, Scott. You make it look good. Ooh, cracked him in the chops. There we go. He's two division champion. Hashtag knockout. Contract earned. This is going to be a big contract, surely. A lifetime fight contract. Every time we fight, we get a million if we win, basically. A million dollar. Just for fighting, just for showing up. Oh, and winning, of course. You know what I mean. Become the greatest, the greatest of all time. And we have an achievement. The ultimate force. Sign a legend contract. We are a legend, guys. So what's the goals for this? Uh, break six performance records. Done four of those already. And break two promotional records. Got to do one more of those. So I guess after that he's done, do we become the, the greatest of all time? Is that how it works? I honestly don't know. We are ticking off these boxes. I love it. I still don't have the fight night bonus yet. Which is really surprising. We've had some really, really epic fights. Short fights. Fairly long fights-ish. I guess a lot of, yeah. I guess a lot of quick fights. But yeah. <laughs> I can't help it, man. We punch hard. We punch very hard. So who is our next opponent? Uh, let's find out. Would it be a welterweight? Is it a lightweight? Do we do both? How does that work? It's, it's quite a big difference. It's a big, it's a big difference. I've only got one option, and that is a welterweight. Robbie Lawler. I will take you on. I've got a four-week camp, medium height. His health is 100. Gravel is 94. It's 98 strike. Man, this guy's a beast. He's lost 23 times. How's he rated? How's he ranked second? All right then. All right. So it's a world to fight again. Um, my rank. So are we just? I believe we're just world to now. 
Yeah, we've lost the title. What a joke. Tony Ferguson has taken my belt. I want both belts. Both belts are mine. I can defend both. That's a bit annoying, isn't it? Let's be honest. That is... That is a bit annoying. So they basically switched... Just switched divisions. I've switched divisions. Why though? I want to dominate both belts. I want both. I made two look so good. That's a joke. Freaking Dana Wyatt. There's one gym we have to unlock right now, and that is this one. Maple Leaf MMA Gym, which is a wrestling gym. Cost a lot to join, but we have the money right now, so... Why the hell not? Land a thousand damage on your chin. Your partner's chin. Let's go for that. Yeah, I like I like level fives, alright? I love it. I love level fives. Come on! That'll do damage! Come on, almost there. Oh nice combo. there we go. Oh, I was gonna finish him off then. <laughs> that would be hilarious. Come on now, you gotta work. Come on! Got like a few more seconds left. Uh oh. We're going back up, right? Finish him off. Come on. No. Punches and bunches. Done it. Like wow. Two seconds left. Next time. <laughs> that was actually surprisingly difficult. It was obviously occasionally blocking. And a thousand damage is a lot. At a lot. Alright, apply these new moves. We've got traditional combo. And that's a big increase. Nice. So that is currently a cage flying knee. This is a flying knee. Ooh, ooh, level five. We have done it before, um, but I switched out the move, I believe. Yeah, so right trigger LB and, and B. A knee to the face is going to hurt, man. It's going to hurt a lot. And lead overhand. I forgot the move. That should be a punch, you'd imagine. There we go. It's currently empty, so that's level five. So that is RBX. Boom! Oh, we've got overhand again, guys. This time with the lead. Ouch, 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 ouch. Does this man not block? Great job. He doesn't block. Good job. Officially punch doesn't block. Is fantastic. I didn't miss a punch, man. That is craziness. A couple of good moves. Uh, plan moves. A level five uppercut. You guys are going to be screwed. Very, very, very nice indeed. My lead uppercut is still bad. So, be and white. Smash it and it will destroy them. Right, key to victory. Your opponent tucks their chin really well for the first minute of each round. So, let's wait for the middle and end of the round to really go for those KOs or those submissions. All right. Thank you for that info. I'm still going to attack them in the first, the first minute. I don't care what you say. I'm going to... I'm going to push into the max. Leading flying double knee. That sounds absolutely devastating. Do not get knocked down by your training partner for 240 seconds. Ugh. Could be hard though, couldn't it? <laughs> Could be very hard. Should I give it a go? I'll give it a go. That's a risk though. So far, I've survived a minute. <laughs> Literally a minute. Sometimes this octagon feels so small. <laughs> it feels so, so, so small. Could go very, very... Oh, no, this is bad. Uh, that's not what I want. Oh, shit. That's how you block. He's not ready for that. Oh, damn. Okay, this is bad. It was going so well, and then man goes crazy. Right, try and get up. Okay, we're getting back up. Thank God for that. Oh, shit. Oh, shit, 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 shit. My head is bad. Shaking a little bit. Oh, do that. Whew. I would have hurt. Right, one minute left. I'm going to be gutted nice if I lose block. this now. But it's going to be... No. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Don't worry. It's all good, it's all good. I'm back at wolf. The cage, man. Sweep away defensive display. Nice block. Oh, block's giving up. Come on oh. oh, I needed that dodge there. I needed that dodge. Keep it going round. Nope. Block. He's just ripping through my block right now. 30 seconds left. Good work. Back away, back away, back away, back away. Back away. Push yourself. Oh shit. Ooh, sort of dodge right into that Good kick. Block. 20 seconds. Oh, my block's giving up. My block's giving up. Nice block. Woo! 10 seconds. I want this to end like right now, please. 
please just end. Oh damn it, damn it, damn it. Great block. You go. Oh shit. No, this is bad. I survived. Is it, we good? We good? We done it? Please? Is it done? It's done. <laughs> We're in confirmation. Two new perks as well. Rush them and zero in. Man, that was tough. Right, so this is currently level one. We can now double double knee. How does that work? Ooh, hoo, hoo. Level five though. You know what's gonna happen. So right trigger, LB and A. Bam. Bam. You know it. Both level five now. Ooh, I don't even feel sorry right now. I don't feel sorry at all. I also got a new takedown. Which I completely forgot about. Take down. So that's left trigger LB. And it's level level four. It's not the best. Oh, there we go. There we go. Boom! Son of a bitch. Increased damage to running punches. I don't read it that too much, to be honest. Increased accuracy on consecutive strikes. That could be really good, actually. Yeah, so if I do my combos, which I do fairly often, like my, my, especially my jabs, be great perfect that was worth doing took ages but it was worth doing uh is this the final week no it's the third week isn't it confirmation any second this is so tense third week good i should probably try and do a tiny bit of promo uh fine i do the uh, the national tv interview great fine check me out on tv tonight it's going to be amazing I don't really know what to work on right now. So, oh, there we go. That that works. So, toughness and heart. 10 points, just pure sprints. We need that badly for health. Oh, this is perfect. Let's keep powering through. 1.5 each, each go. Yeah. I'm going to do this again on the next the next week as well. That health's going to dramatically improve. Oh, this is some good training. Just constant sprints. We're getting fitter every day. Really good training there, perfect. I love when you find two attributes you need and you just power through them. Really, really good feeling. They still want us to do this photo shoot. I'm not really that bothered right now, to be honest. Uh, I spent a bit of time with my fans, playing some games. There we go, 20 points spent. Right, where's those sprints again? <laughs> they were good. Submission offense. I do need to improve that as well, though. Um, I'll come. I'll, we come back here next uh, for the, after the next fight for more training. 100%. Right. Will we max out? We are maxed out on heart. Toughness is almost done. We have still got 30 points left. Perfect. So let's now work on accuracy. Just to get that up. To 100. Accuracy is now 100% done. Submission offense. 0.7. Surprised my submission uh, defense is actually that high. I guess, yeah, I guess when we get into submission. Yeah, I guess that does make sense. Oh, our health, guys, is now 100. Our first stat to reach that. Perfect. Uh, footwork needs to be improved on striking, and that's it. Let me max that. Gravel is still horrific. Fitness, endurance does. Ooh, let's work on endurance. Look at that, guys. All 100. All of it. Health is maxed out. Right, guys, so that is the fight training done. We have a high height, which is not too bad. Oh. Okay. <laughs> we got punished for not going to that photo shoot. I don't want to go to the photo shoot. All right? Screw you. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching, though. Leave a like on the video, and I'll see you guys very soon. Bye-bye.